So Ocean Zay, is it any good? Let's find out. So if it's your first time to this channel and you love movies and martial arts, consider hitting that subscribe button. Ocean's 8, starring Sandra Bullock, Kate Blanchett, Helen Bullock Carter, and Rihanna. I came into this movie with kind of low expectations because I was like, oh, okay, another remake of a film, but you're doing a female version of it, like they did with Ghostbusters. And I was just thinking to myself, hey, why don't you just make another movie, you know, instead of just trying to rehash a movie that had an all-male cast and switch it to an all-female cast. But surprisingly, I really enjoyed this movie. It was really good. And that actually wasn't really an issue. That was actually a good thing. Because if you don't know the plot, it's following Sandra Bullock's character, who's Danny Ocean, George Clooney's original character from the original series of films. That's his sister. Now, the film actually follows kind of a similar plot to Ocean's Eleven, I found, you know. You, instead of Danny Ocean coming out of prison and wanting to do this job to kind of get revenge on someone, it's now his sister doing the same thing. But I didn't find that to be too much of a, oh, they're just copying the original. I think it really worked really well. And the job, the way that they pulled off the job was really interesting. Very slick. All the actors in the film did a really good job, particularly Sandra Bullock and um, Kate Banchet. I thought they were really good. They kind of mimicked Brad Pitt and George Clooney a little bit in their personalities and kind of in the roles that they were they were in. They were the two close friends who kind of could read each other's minds and kind of in sync and kind of know each other very well and do the recruiting. And that was the same with Brad Pitt's character and George Clooney, Danny Ocean. In the, in the Ocean series, particularly in Ocean's Eleven. And I felt that it was a very good mirror to Ocean's Eleven. I love heist movies. I love those kind of movies where there's a crew of people coming together, trying to, you know, get something that's very precious and finding out a way to do something that's seemingly impossible. And there's always a twist, you know, I won't spoil the twist at the end of the movie, but, but it's just great that there were moments of tension in the movie. There was moments of humor as well. It's not a comedy per se, just like the first one wasn't really a comedy. The first series of movies weren't really comedies, even though they had comedic elements into them. But it was very kind of lighthearted, very like, it's like a banter kind of fe fest kind of a, of a film. I, I really enjoyed it for that. I would say, Apart from the main two characters, Anne Hathaway was pretty good in the movie. I liked Rihanna's role in the movie, she's a small role. She, she's not as major an actress or as, as high caliber an actress as, as, as those guys I've mentioned. Helen and the Boyle Carter, she was pretty good in the movie as well. A lot of charisma on the screen. It was a really enjoyable movie, worth watching. I love the music in the movie and it's what I loved about the first series of movies as well was that kind of hip music that they had. There's a few cameos from original cast members. I won't say which ones. It was really enjoyable. And so again, surprisingly, I enjoyed it more than I thought I would. And I actually think it's really worth watching. I would actually give Ocean's 8 a four out of five. Definitely check it out if you haven't. It's, it's a good time at the cinema. I found it was great because it wasn't just a gimmicky, oh, let's just do an all female version of a franchise that had an all male cast in it and just do a female version of that. It, it wasn't that at all. It was actually very cleverly done and it made sense. They're going after diamonds, women love diamonds, so <laughs> it kind of made sense as well. It was a really slick, intelligent, classy film and I really loved it. I enjoyed it and I definitely recommend it if you haven't seen it. If you like this video, hit that like button, share, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know if you've seen Ocean's 8 and what you thought of the movie. What did you enjoy most about the movie? And let's have a discussion. Anyway, I'll see you on the channel for some more movie reviews and a lot. Peace.